Legend of Total War here. Well, Legend of Total can't count again. Uh, with part 41. This is the actual part 41. The previous episode was part 40 of my Europa Universe Alice 4 Let's Play campaign in France. Alright, so previously we delivered a pretty pretty good blow to the Ottomans, giving us... Uh, it, was, it was sort of like a little bit of conquest and a little bit of humiliation to them, uh, just because we couldn't really take Venice's claims in addition to Naples' claims without taking diplomatic power hit. Even though it didn't cost that much, I really need my diplomatic power for the annexation of these two guys down here, which we haven't even gotten one of them started, and Ajaran is 42% complete. So I need to get on with that. We need to finish up with this war against Austria very quickly. Okay, as soon as we take their, their capital, that should do it. And I'm going to spend a little bit of time in Europe pushing my luck to see how far we can conquer before people being like, okay, that's enough, France. A coalition. And they'll be like, okay, 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 I'll stop. Depends on the size of the coalition. Okay, well, I don't really make much money from vassals anyway, but whatever. I guess you can start coming back home. Okay, our guy's back. We haven't taken Vienna yet, but let's just see what we can get. The The whole point of the war score, the war goal, was to return these two settlements to Venice, which is not really worth much in terms of uh, war score. If I then ask for money, I can get a fair bit out of that. Don't really care about Salzburg. You'll annul your treaties with, let me see, war reparations, yep. And annul pretty much all of your treaties. No, I, uh, look, these guys were not really that difficult of a uh, enemy anyway. I mean, I don't really need to be taking money from them, really. But... The point is not necessarily to make lots of money, but to keep them in debt. Because when they're in debt, it's just not a good place to be. Because they have to take out heaps of loans, they can't pay it back, they have to default on their loans, and it fucks up their economy. So, it's, it's less about, you know, like I said, less about me getting rich, but more about keeping them weak. So they don't enter other wars, but again, they're not the Holy Roman Emperor anymore. Bohemia is. They're, no, they're not going to become the Holy Roman Emperor ever again, because they're, they're Protestant. And the Catholics won the uh, the official faith. Anyway, let's let's be done with this. Yeah. There we go. Not not a huge victory, but it only took us a few months, maybe a year, to win the war. It it wasn't a big deal. So. Looking now at Savoy, allied with Lithuania, Teutonic Order, Bohemia, Lorraine, and Flanders. Bohemia used to be... Funny story about Bohemia. I was allied to them at the beginning of the campaign. They got really big. They had a coalition against them. I ditched them. They got smashed by the, uh, the coalition. Then somehow managed to work their way into becoming the Holy Roman Emperor. So now they're more of a concern than Austria. And as for Hungary, who is not really a valuable ally, but an ally nonetheless, I'm trying I want them to lose all their territory. M well not all their territory, but most of their territory. I just don't want to do it myself. Because if I own any of their cause, they'll never accept vassalization from me. But the Ottomans will never declare war on them while I'm allied to them. It just won't happen. So, in some ways, I'm protecting them. Maybe I shouldn't anymore. Let them let them fall to pieces. They've they've basically got no allies. They've never once joined one of my wars. I've never have I been called into any of theirs. I don't think so. So I just spend the last of my favors, get really good trust with them. That shouldn't go down over time because let me see my trust with Bohemia. Oh, it definitely did. 
definitely went down. What happened with Mexico, right? Because I built up my trust with them. It's still, it's still good. I guess if you don't have any more agreements with them, that's when it's like, yeah, we don't, we don't have any more agreements with you, sort of thing. All right, you need to be picking them up. Oh shit, I, I didn't realize I selected it. Oh god, fucking damn it. Oh, hang on, hang on. Is there a... Remove transport ships from here? Nope. It's okay, just come down the bottom. Oh, I could just do this. Fucking hell. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Wait, what? Hang on, hang on, that doesn't look right. I did the wrong one, that's why. It's this one. So, do I or do I not declare war on Savoy? Because I don't want to go to war with Bohemia in there. Well, it's not... It would only be at war with Bohemia. Bohemia by themselves probably isn't that big of a deal. Bohemia, 19,000 men. Eh, whatever. You know, not not something pleasant to deal with, but nothing to be too concerned about. Because i got permanent claims on Savoy that I want to take. Good administration power for it. I can afford some overextension. Who are their other allies again? Lithuania. Well, let's just see if they'll even show up. So, Bohemia doesn't want to do it because they're too far in debt, so moot point there. Teutonic Order, who cares? Lithuania, well, too far away for me to really care. They'll bring an army all the way over here and then I'll just stomp them, hopefully. Lorraine and Flanders. Now, do I have anything on Flanders? I do have a claim on Ghent. Anyway, so that just means we're going to have to get an army up over here. Ready to deal with that. Now, as for you, you've been very useful, but if we're going to go to war out here, you should probably be a little bit more careful. What I, what I might do for just a little while during this war, come over here, we'll upgrade these ships. They're in due, due for a big upgrade. Still got the tier ones. Yeah, that's fine. Give them their upgrade and just sit there for a while because they need to repair. Because during this war here, I don't want them sailing. Pick you up. Take you over here. I suppose it doesn't really matter if you just stay there for the time being. So how many claims do we have here? One, two, three. Ah, oh, we actually already have some claims in France. Uh, in, uh, in Milan. So we're just getting three. Okay, that's fine. The claims that we're pressing over here are for Naples. Yeah, you could use some repairs. And also, we're preparing a... Oh, right, we're at peace now. It's It's time. This, this should have been done ages ago. They should be done fairly close together. If I had to guess, I'd say Kilwer will be done first. Now, that only gives me two diplomats to work with now. Okay. We'll start this war here before any of the others. Just give me one month, and I'll recall this spy. Oh, 
I could do that to stop myself from falling behind time. But that's going to cost me... I'm going to only have, like, such a small buffer. I can't increase this any further because I've already got a level 5 guy here. But if I don't do this, I'm going to fall behind time. I'm just going to do it anyway. Okay, fabricate another claim. I don't really care where. There, fine. And then recall him. Okay, so I don't think I'm going to need the transport ships too much. I don't know, I'll keep them there. Because I got, I got two loads of transport ships out that way. Okay, as soon as he gets back, it's it's go time. Ha, huh, good stuff. Gain 100 diplomatic power with this, so that was lucky. That just helps to buffer, buffer this stuff. I mean, that'll be done in a few years. It doesn't look like it's too unstable out there now. They fixed up their, um, their religious problems and their um, overextension. Let's do this. So, we've got three claims to press here. And now Bohemia... Oh, that short amount of time brought Bohemia into the war. <sighs> oh, well. I should go straight for their capital. So, who am I at war with? Lithuania. Okay. Let's go then. Does Hungary have any allies at all apart from me? No, they don't. So if I if I drop them, the Ottomans will be like, mine, 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 mine. And that's kind of what we want. Bye bye. Let's see how long they last before the Ottomans declare war. Because the Ottomans, don't they have like permanent claims? There they do. They'll be like, oh my god, this is the best thing ever. France taketh, t France giveth. I do giveth, but I will also taketh again. Hang on, where, where is the other... I really don't want to fight Bohemia. This was 19,000 troops. What about Lithuania? We didn't even check them. Where do they stand on all this? 29,000. Eh, it's not too bad. I think it's going to be hard to get a war score without knocking them out of the war. I don't want to travel all the way out that way. Whatever. Let's just head over to Bohemia. Is that their capital there? Yeah. You're coming with us. Knock Bohemia out of the war, and then knock Lithuania out of the war. Okay, that's going to speed that up considerably. Let me just see, what does that mean for, for this as well? Gives us, wow, a 12% chance of annexing them upon death. Huh. Maybe I shouldn't be pressing any more claims for them. How old is my king? 51 years old, 12%. How am I going to get some more diplomatic reputation? 
There's some here. There's two. And as far as I can see, that's all there is. Yeah, I just... Don't worry about it too much. Good if it happens, but it doesn't en end up happening, whatever. I'm still going to keep expanding them. Got a free diplomat. What should I be doing with him? i just leave it. So we're trying to knock these guys out of the war one at a time. That should be enough to knock them out. I don't want to pay you any money. Hmm. Maybe I'll stay with you and get that in the peace treaty. You should have peaced out when you had the chance. Bitch. Oh, I forgot about you. Get over here. Yeah, there was a few ships here that need to be replaced. really putting up any real threat. Other way around. Hit him there, because he's got level 1 siege. Yeah, whatever. This is happening very quickly, though. Of course, the ivory thing could end at any time. I'm surprised that the Ottomans aren't declaring war yet. What are they, in a regency? No? That guy is pretty fucking good. This guy here is the youngest. I think I'll hire him, and then just promote him. How much money have I got coming in? Oh my god, so much money. Because that guy's nine years older. Ah, oh, fuck it, I'll just get that guy. Well, Savoy is basically knocked out of the war straight away. It's to be expected. Now, wasn't there someone else over... Lorraine is... At war with us. Oh yeah, I've got claims on them as well. Yoink. Thick out here. That was occupied very quickly. Still no sign of any Lithuanians out here. Now, since these guys are essentially our biggest enemy because they're the Holy Roman Emperor, we want to embarrass them as much as we possibly can. So I just want to get them out of the war quickly, because we've got to t go take on Lithuania now. Although, we should probably make sure we're actually over there first. Otherwise, if we do it right now, 
we'll just, um, we'll have to come back over here and then go back over. This is, of course, assuming Poland's gonna let us walk through their land. Do I not have that ho- Oh, I don't have a royal marriage with Hungary anymore. Eh, whatever. Just wondering if trust is gonna go down. Trust with them may have gone down because I think we may have been at war with them once or twice. Actually, I don't know about that. Cool. Okay, there's Bohemia. So we can knock them out of the war easily enough. Preferably before they... Who's this? Is that Lorraine? Yeah. I should have got some guys over to Corsica. Maybe these two guys when, when they're finished. Alright, over to Lithuania we go. To knock them out of the war. Now, the downside to this is... Oh my god, look at Russia. Oh, you guys are fucking idiots. Must be Bolsheviks. Okay, they buggered off. Get onto the water, and then... Over there you go. It'd be quicker to pick him up from the coast, but eh, can't be stuffed. Alright, good. All of our men are out of there. So... Oh, I trust it's going down a little bit. Since we've got even more out of you, you're going to cancel more treaties. Ah, oh, I should have waited. It's too late now. Gonna go all the way back. I thought as soon as I got into Poland I'd be okay, but I guess not. Actually, go back this way. As soon as we land there, we should fight the, um, the Teutonic Order. Oh, yeah, going to war with Lithuania is a, it's just a pain in the ass. It's just too far away. I wish I checked where that was. Could fucking be anywhere. We're ready to go over here. Okay, I think the riskiest move. Oops, hang on. The riskiest move here is going to be the initial drop off into Brunei, especially considering... Yeah, that's, that's actually a good point. That is going to be the riskiest move. Let's take him... Let's just take out Passai first. And we'll worry about Brunei afterwards. No, 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 no. We're declaring war on Brunei. Actually, if we declare war on them, we have to worry about Sulu. But I, oh wait, if I, I've got to make them co-belligerents, don't I? I don't know. It doesn't matter. Just, just declare war on them. What are they going to do, really? Just do this until our, our fleet can get here. So no great priorities there. This war here is not going to last much, that much longer. Ah, that's where the revolt happened. Castilian separatists. So there's the Lithuanian army. Cool, so I can grab myself another general now. Oh, 
can't. I'll have to do this first. Okay, cool. As long as we don't get some stupid thing happen to us, we should be okay. It only lasts 10 years. And how good is that general? He's okay. 3-3-2, three, three, no good at sieges, whatever. Alright, now, back over to Lithuania. Actually, not all of you, some of you... Yeah, it, it doesn't matter, there's no forts there, it just doesn't matter. When you're done here, you're going to go and fight them. There's also the Teutonic Order up here. Wreck their fleet. Where are you going to go? Well, whatever. I don't really, don't really care. Well, you're going to have to get some repairs before you head over to Brunei. Two star general, it's alright. Nothing special, but better than nothing. Okay, so we can. No, no, no. It's still too far ahead of schedule. That's gonna hit zero soon. Yeah, Lithuania, I'm not letting you get back over here to stop us from. Oh, look, Naples is already ahead of us. Just wanna knock them out of the war. If we had called Russia into this, well, Russia's a bit busy, it seems. I don't really care about their peasants' war. Oh, fuck. Alright, when you're done, you have to get back over there. Okay, they're not coming back for a while. Let me just see what I can get out of this now. Because like I said, fighting fighting over there is a waste of time. Whoa, man, we can't get much out of this. It's worth a lot of war score. Could separate piece for it, but I won't get it diplomatic free. That's all the stuff I need from them. And I can still take Ghent. That's a 95% victory score needed. Alright, so we're, we're going to have to knock out Lithuania. Alright, and just go over to face the Teutonic Order anyway. Nothing else. Oh, hang on. God, if I had pursued them, they would have gotten wiped out. Fuck me. Stupid rebels being priority. I'm not done with colonization yet. Fabricate claims on Ancona. Yep. And then we hand that over to Naples. Fucking pricks. Oh, we got your pincered, you bitch. Next time, stay out of your own 
You mind your own business. Gotcha, bitch. Fuck off and die, Lithuanian scum. Yep, they got stack wiped. Very nice. We're almost at max manpower as well. Just killing it in terms of finances. Don't have to worry about that at all. I don't need to turn off the uh, forts, even though I think they're a little bit of a waste. You know, during peacetime, that is. Now, obviously, we need it. Keeps the filth out. Huh, Kilwa came all the way over here. Oh yeah, I forgot I was fighting a war over here. I didn't make any fucking orders. Mm. 27,000 of them. Like I said, I'm in no rush over here. Where do I put my soldiers? Okay, they're just standing in Austria. I really don't want to send them all the way over here, but we, we've got to put a stop to this. Actually, let's see if we can separate piece out of them now. We just took their capital. Whew, that's a lot of money. Yeah, we definitely don't want them to be allied to Litho uh, to Milan because they're next. No, you know what? Don't revoke your cause. That's fine. All right, pretty moderate peace treaty there. That massively increased our war score. You guys all come home now. We are done with this war. As soon as the the diplomats returned. We're done here. Fucking rebels. Okay, you're all good to go. Alright, good. Get over here. We can't really fight this war here without naval support. Can bang him if you can. much money to be had in that anyway. So Bohemia is probably going to be like, you need to give that back. But then again, they've got a peace treaty with us, so they can't do shit about it. These guys might join the coalition against me. Let's have a look. Castile, Savoy, Luca, Austria, none of these matter. Morocco, Milan, Passai, Aachen, Frankfurt, Switzerland, Württemberg. Flemington, Lorraine, Arthbach, blah, 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 blah. None of them really matter. I, I probably shouldn't take them all on at once, but I feel like I could. Because, like, Castile is an example. It's too weak. Too weak to do anything against us. 
Now, if I brought, you know, my colonists over here, they'd absolutely wreck them. I'd have way too many forces for them to deal with it. Ooh, a lot of admin power needed, but this is a good time for to do it. Now we give it a bit of a rest because this is going to take three years, roughly, to to get these territories into us. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, what do we need to do next? These two will go into me. That'll go to Naples. I guess just bring out the soldiers home now. And we got this war over here to fight. Kilwa has almost been incorporated. Oh shit. It's fighting them in different locations. Uh, it's fine. Where are they going? Get over here. Oh god. Take it. It's gonna cause more separatism in their country. Now, have we got a peace treaty with them? Okay, well then we should go to war with Castile, because like this isn't gonna increase my overextension. And we've still got, let's see. One, two. We've got a few wars to go before I actually finish doing... What's this? No, you keep your Berber traditions out of here. Fuck. Alright, I'll clean this up for you. Oh, don't forget about me. That's got to be dealt with. How long until these claims run, run off? Seven years. I guess we better get onto that. We got a bit more time with that. So we're not done in Europe yet. So no one's joining a coalition against me. They just don't feel like it's powerful enough. I basically need to piss off more people because it didn't piss off the Ottomans enough. Their aggressive expansion of me is only 16. Not enough. Probably don't need to send that many troops over to Castile. It seems like they've only got 4,000 men. Because we, we've got side over their entire border because we border them on every region. So let's get started, shall we? Ah, uh, there's also their allies. Moravia, Bosnia, the Knights. I don't know why we bother with the Knights. More or less not a concern. Anyway, you're here, you can take on Bosnia. Do we have any claims on them at all? They're just a nuisance. It's the best way to put them, they're a nuisance. So someone's going to have to go to Moravia to 
to punish them for getting involved in this. What was the other one? Oh, the knights. Yeah, don't even bother with them. And you're going to need to get pick up by it. Grand Revolts. No, Gand Revolts. Oh my god. Alright, you're going to have to go and deal with that. Gand is definitely ours. Looks like we've already wiped out their army. So they found themselves a new ally, Bohemia. Still, I, I think once the Ottomans repair their economy, they're not going to have too much difficulty just stomping Hungary. Gotta try to stop them from recruiting. And how are we going over here? Because like I said, I haven't been paying much attention to it at all. Well, we're not losing any territory, as far as I can tell. What's this? Fucking Australia cunt has been sending a fleet to... This is, this is funny. Uh, sending a fleet to come help us fight, and they're losing. Typical, typical lazy cunts. Alright. Yeah, my fleet still hasn't arrived. Uh, where are they? They're not too far off. Okay. Didn't need them to come here. How big can I make my fleet? I can still raise another hundred ships, because what I'm thinking is that I'll have a, a, a European fleet and an Asian fleet. I don't need one in America, we got that under control. So, let's get going with that then, shall we? This will take a little while to build, but when it's done, I'm going to have to keep sending my fleet around all over the place. Then next technology becomes outdated. Whatever. I got money. I got money up my, coming out my ass here. And then we need these. Okay. Cool. So that'll take something like six or seven years to get done, but that's fine. Okay, we don't have a peace treaty with England anymore, so well, let's get going. Then again, our overextension. Maybe I should be a bit more cautious with this. Um, 
you just stay here. Definitely want the territory. Oh, god damn it. So, so this is where they've arrived. And that's slowing down this considerably. Uh, I'm going to have to send some reinforcements. Oh, there's rebellions here as well. Alright, um, land over here. And they'll make our way and just sweep them up. So is that Brunei? No, that's a Sulu. Who the fuck is Sulu? Let's get a separate piece with Bosnia and just kick him out of the war. I don't want their territory, I just want them to fuck off. Okay, they got some ships over here. Take them out, this is where we're going. This is the first place we're going to fight. I can't let this stand. This is slowing slowing this down considerably. They can deal with that. Oh god fucking damn it. Ass in this shit. So that is Oh our cogs are there. But same with the Brunei's cogs, or transport ships. And Brazil's got... It's mostly a battle of cogs, transport ships. But we've got leadership through Brazil, they don't. Oh god, god fucking damn it. Bloody Asia. Oh, luckily the fort's there, so that's okay. Looks like... Did we take some of their ships? I don't think so. Okay, there we go. Our fleet's on top of that. So you might be better off meeting them ahead here. You could use a rest. So it's not progressing at all. Which is okay because it's giving us um, diplomatic power. It can't progress while it's like this. But still, it's, it's tying up one of our diplomats. I just want to get it over with. Like I said, this guy, he needs his repairs. You're going to have to come over here and repair the stuff. Yeah, in favouring the European wars, I've neglected... Oh, hang on. Neglected the other wars. Protect trade in the English Channel. Not that we really need to. For money, we're just killing it. How are we going with tariffs and stuff? Tariffs are at 39. Good. Don't worry, Kilwa. I'm coming. Damn, it should have landed there. Oh 
Oh, God damn it. Oh, fuck. Oh. Keep making the decisions too late. Yeah, that's right. Now, what are you going to do, bitch? They lost their capital. So, looks like Ajaran is definitely going to be done first now. I didn't just send someone back here, did I? Hmm. These guys are actually a lot stronger than I thought. No, 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 What the fuck? Right. Those guys buggered off somewhere else. You're gonna have to come out here and retake all this stuff. You're gonna have to help. See, it's not, it's not just the, um... It's not just the forces they sent here, it's also the rebels, Mombas and Separatists. We can't just let them stay here, they've got to die. Alright, well the war against Castile is more or less done. If we just wait for that... We're not even asking for much, let's just see what we can get. That's all we're asking for. And also, cancel your, your fucking alliances, please. The Knights are no threat, but Moravia probably would have been a bit of a nuisance. No one really cares that much about it. It's most of them are just like minus one to minus four. Castile obviously cares the most. But they'll be in a peace treaty for the next 14, 15 years. So, and even when they do come out of it, what are they going to do, really? Wait a second. What I could do is just like claim them all and then just give them all to Navarra. Because that'll also decrease their liberty desire. I think that's what we'll do next time. Alright, time to go home. Like we could use some help over here, but we're a little bit busy with with Adjaran. Ah, oh, not Adjaran. Um, Kilwa. Got to get, got to get the annexation continuing. Kilwa's almost finished. Okay, cool. It's time to do this. Yep, I was just thinking, that's all. When's the next idea? Uh, 22, so we're a little while away from that. This will be done soon. I haven't done any military technologies yet. Um, ideas. Soon though, soon. Okay, so we can start building cathedrals. Be a good idea if you have a general who will be most useful. Let's get you. Well, it's good to see Adjuran's coming in here and helping us out. How's our fucking. What are you doing? Alright, we'll get back over here. This is where we're gonna need you the most. 
Take you out there, fleets. We're actually losing the war. It's just because of the ticky war score, we haven't gone for the goal yet. As soon as we grab that, we'll be winning. Had to prioritize the European war. Probably should have, in hindsight, should have waited a little bit longer. We weren't ready for this. We didn't prepare enough. Because they don't just sit around waiting for you to come for them. Like, they come at you. Which is what happened when I was busy fighting other, more important wars. Bring this guy home. I don't think we're going to fight any more European wars for a little while. Oh, who am I kidding? I'm going to go take on England. As soon as, as soon as our, um, as soon as this is, oh, it's already signed anyway. There's so many fucking rebels. I don't know if Killbot was worth all the trouble. Alright, cool. At least that's one load of rebels gone. See if we can wipe out the Sulu army. Nice. Good job there. Cool, Bahamas are done. Three done at once. Wait, what? Oh, that's Bermuda. This is the Bahamas, right. Bloody Netherlands. Fuck off. This is my area. Okay. Well, I'll just, you know, I'll get the colonies off them eventually. Let's claim this because Cuba won't do it. Oh my god, is each individual fucking island another? You know, they actually might colonize these areas here. Because you can get there via land. Where's my other colony? Oh, I got another merchant. How long has he been sitting there for? Okay, where are we sending you? We got 41% over here, but there's not a whole lot of money there. What about over here? This is sort of where we're putting our fingers in the pie a little bit. I've already got one there, and we're making, we're, we're collecting quite a bit. They're shifting a lot over this way. I'm going to put it here. Probably won't get much. But since we're going to be, we're, we're heavily involved in this area, it should pay dividends eventually. Gotta clear out those damn fleets. Take out the fucking rebels. Good. Why'd that go up? It should be under 16. 
Increase over time. Defender of... Okay, we go. That's fine. Good. How's our inflation? It's going up. So we'll soon have all those cores in... Um, oh, around here. So it's time to go to war with England. Okay, good. We cleared out. We're clearing out most of the stuff now. You can afford to get picked up and get taken back, back to the war zone. All right, you head over there. I don't even know where Sulu is. Maybe I should find out. Is this, is this them here? Just that? Fucking hell. No wonder I couldn't find them. Okay, as soon as that's taken, the annexation will continue. Which is good. Okay, we got to invade Brunei. Actually, we're at an hour, so I suppose we'll end the episode here. So, a little bit of a setback over here, but now the invasion is in full swing. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> and I don't expect to be uh, delayed any longer. Anyway, that's the end of this episode, so like and subscribe, part 40. Two is next. I get the episodes wrong numbers wrong so often in this. And yeah, and don't forget to visit me on Facebook and all that shit. See you next time, fuckers.